Introduction to the Book of Job Job is the book of the Bible known for raising the perplexing question of human suffering, and in particular, the suffering of the righteous. If God is all-powerful and loving toward all He has made, then why does He allow suffering? How can the justice of an almighty God be defended in the face of evil, especially the suffering of the innocent? Job is clearly a blameless man who suffers gravely from losing his ten children, most of his servants, and all of his numerous livestock. Then he is afflicted physically with painful sores all over his body. Nevertheless, he refuses to curse God. Job's three friends attempt to comfort him, though they insist that he has surely sinned for such calamities to befall him. But Job repeatedly defends his integrity, and lastly, God speaks. The events of the book of Job can be dated quite early, certainly before 1000 BC. Through this penetrating drama, we observe that all suffering must be seen in light of the cosmic struggle of Satan against God. Through it, we begin to understand what Job discovered, that God is sovereign and perfectly just in all His ways, even when we don't know or can't understand His purposes.